transform it into what it can become. What it can become. The nature. The nature. The nature of what we're up against now. I'm in Philadelphia. So maybe I should make a campaign speech from Philadelphia. Anybody in here tell me if this sounds familiar to you. But if I'm elected, I'm going to be so tough that I'll make a tell of the Hun look like a fan. Now I'm not going to go into all that was wrong with that. Understand the mentality that resonated enough with a certain sector of the population in this city that that man who said it became the mayor, former police commissioner, former police officer, by the name of Frank Rizzo. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it resonates here. It resonates here. And what did he mean by that? Well, I'm going to tell you what he meant by that. You all understand what he meant by that because he basically just prophesied what was going to happen to those who would speak clearly and call him by his right name. You know his right name. Fascist dog. The right name. And his prodigy are in the street revving up motorcycles and taking pictures. Right now, direct line of continuity between what there was there today and what there was then when Rizzo made that speech. We got some work to do. We got some work to do. Not just in Philadelphia, but everywhere. Everywhere Frank Rizzo lives. But I'm going to do the album, the famous 51 Shots. Frank Rizzo lives in a young man by the name of Bell up in the Queens within the last month on the eve of his wedding being shot by a cop who not only fired every round in his weapon but reloaded and fired every round in the next magazine and they're studying to see if this was an undue use of force. Undue use of force. We had one like that in Denver. Exact same set of circumstances. Cop gets brushed on the knee of the car as a surrounding thing. He fires every round in his butt, reloads. Fires every round again. 51 shots on the owl. 50 shots on Bell. 37 of them by the same guy. A week ago, I was in Atlanta, DeKalb County. 12 black men under the age of 25 in the last 11 months. Got something called stolen lives. Looks like a small city telephone directory. And it's just small pictures, vital details of people gunned down under exactly similar circumstances by the police. By the police. In the past decade, not much more. Hundreds and hundreds of names and all justifiable shootings. According to the police who investigate themselves every time this happens. 